Hey guys, today I'll be showing you how to make a Lego Minecraft Magma Cube. But before we start, I have to tell you something. On our channel, we don't just do Lego building videos, we do Connects building videos, Beyblade videos. We also have another channel called Pasta Tube Gaming. Do gaming videos such as Minecraft, Cosmos, Roblox, Balloon Sea Battles, Grand Pie of Rome, Among Us, Stickwell Legacy, and new game Balloon Sea Battles 2, and eventually a new game Stickwell Legacy 3. Whew, that was a tongue twister. So if you don't know what a magma cube is, a magma cube is literally what I'm going to be building. So I'm technically building the whole thing. They're just a square. It's te if you don't know what a slime is, they're technically like a slime, except they can they can walk, they can jump on lava. Um. They don't take full damage, um, because, because, and they, and they're also bouncy on every block. And they have, and, and if you see a big magma cube and, and you want to like one shot it with your sword, well that's not how it works, because magma cubes can turn into smaller versions of themselves. But they but if they were like the small list of them all, they I they have a low chance of dropping magma cream. And if you don't know what's the use of magma cream, you can use it for brewing potions, and as well you can use it for other things like making magma blocks. And I think that's all you can do with magma cream. Just brew potions and make magma blocks with it. I mean, it's not too useful. It's not too useful. However, slime blocks are more useful, like a hundred times more useful than magma. The magma cream only because. It can be used in complicated redstone machines. Like it can be in, it can be used in many farms. Like too many farms, they're just too complicated for me. It can even be used to make sticky pistons. But of course, we're talking about the magma. But yeah, so here is the finished thing. I. Hope you guys like it, subscribe to see my videos, bye guys.